What is going on YouTube? Uh, almost had this engine together for the V6 swap and I thought I'd take you on a little tour of what's going on inside one of these H25s or H27s, the 2.5 liter or 2.7 liter V6s of the Suzuki family. Uh, so, I'll show you what's going on inside of these things here. Timing covers off, valve covers off. I just got done putting the timing chain kit on. So, in case you're getting into a timing chain job or you're just generally curious of what's going on behind these covers, this is what's going on. There's a lot going on. So, you have uh, the crank, main crank sprocket, main tensioner. This is the primary, the primary shoe, tensioner shoe. Main chain comes up. Then you have the right bank cams. They're in, they're torqued. This is the right hand bank timing chain and there's a tensioner. Uh, you can barely see it, but there's a tensioner down in there for this timing chain. Uh, there's the kind of the guide comes out, intake cam comes out to the drive sprocket, which the main primary chain attaches to. And you have a plastic chain guide, you have an idler sprocket, and then you have the left bank, which each cam has its own timing sprocket, which runs off the left hand bank secondary chain. Uh, then the primary chain comes up and drives this sprocket, and here is the tensioner. This is the tensioner for the left hand bank intake and exhaust. And here is the top guide on this side. And it comes down off the primary into another plastic timing chain guide. So that is the system. The water pump is, if you ever have to do one, it's located behind the timing cover. You got to pull the timing cover to get to it. It's right here. Kind of sucks, but it is what it is. And then here's your water or coolant inlet and outlet. And your thermostat goes on this one right here. And then I also have, oh yeah, here is the uh, oil pump, which is chain drive. If you ever do a timing chain or a water pump, you always want to check this and tighten up the manual tensioner to get your chain slack to a reasonable amount. Uh, and then underneath is your main cap uh, with your crank and your crank caps. And there is the pickup tube, which I cleaned while I had everything apart. So that is what's behind the covers, an H25 or H27 Suzuki motor. And there's your spark plug wells, uh, dual overhead cam, the ride on hydraulic valve buckets or hydraulic lifters, which are supplied with oil pressure to expand to the correct height. And this little cushion. So there you go. There's what's behind the covers. Hope you enjoyed. Hope you found it informational. Uh, hopefully next video. Cut this thing in there. Have a good one.